This is a last minute trip that my buddy and I made with our families to get our kids out to have a fire and show them how to make peach cobbler in the Dutch oven. Buddy Josh has a Jeep Rubicon and I'm running a Forerunner. This trail is not too difficult. Uh, it's obviously a lot different in the dark versus daylight. It's kind of an odd trail. You almost think you'd end up finding Yoda somewhere in here with how swampy and marshy it looks. Um, we ended up finding a good spot to start a fire, got our fire going, get a good coal base going so we can uh, do our peach cobbler. And I show how to uh, do that process uh, after this little off-road video. show how to do Dutch oven peach cobbler. Pretty simple <clears throat> process. You need two cans of peaches, canned peaches. These are Safer. 29, oun 29 ounces each. I think I'm already breaking the can opener. We're gonna dump both cans in. Then you take your dry mix, just a uh, cake. You can use yellow or white cake mix. Want to evenly spread this across the top. And then add cinnamon, however much you'd like. And then you're using half a stick of butter. You kind of want to slice that up and spread that throughout randomly also. Josh, I buttered your uh, knife up for you good. Yeah, that's ready to go. <laughs> so, it's pretty uh, easy. Put 15 coals on the bottom. You're going to spread those out, and then you're going to put 10 coals on top. And it's going to take about 45 minutes for this to cook. You want to turn it about every 15 minutes. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the whole pot, and then I'm also going to turn the lid so it cooks evenly. So now we're going to move our coals. Oh. 
That's six. Seventy-nine. The cocket. Eleven, twelve. Thirteen-ish. Fourteen-ish. That's probably close enough. Try to spread these out evenly on the lid, also, so you're not getting hot spots. We're cooking, bud. Josh, did you stop counting for me? I can't concentrate. Hey, nobody's good at me. No. <laughs> Close enough. All right, so we're gonna let this sit for about 45 minutes, and we'll see how it looks. Cold night, it took us a little longer to cook it than we expected. It's probably a little over an hour now, and see how it all turned out. All right, Josh, you get to be the first one. Cans, peaches. I think they're like 30 ounces. Yeah. Uh, cake mix, some uh, cinnamon on top, and I think the only way it'd be better is probably with some ice cream. So you're like five bucks into this, and it's like the best thing you can get. Oh yeah. <laughs> Late night, Road. freezing temperatures, Late camping. Late night, a little bit. You're not you're not hungover yet. <laughs> you're gonna be, <laughs> but it's certainly gonna help it. That's yeah. Sure. Leftovers for breakfast. Uh -huh. Yeah. Very good. Well, you like it. We'll have to do it more. Yep, absolutely. If you like the video, please like and subscribe. Appreciate the support, trying to grow the channel. Uh, it definitely helps uh, with getting other gear to get out filming and uh, creating more content. Uh, any suggestions for camp cooking recipes, uh, please add them in the comments. Uh, any suggestions on how to make it better, appreciate it. Uh, thanks for watching.